Hello sewing friends, welcome back to my sewing room. Today is Friday Sews and I have a lot to tell you so stay tuned and I'm going to show you the dress I've been working on this week. And here's the pin tuck dress I just made a tutorial on that will go with my um, pin tuck dress pattern once I um, get that finished. And so here I'll let you see the dress in full length. Here's my pretty pin tuck dress made out of cotton fabric. And for a more casual look, I like to pair it with my jean jacket. I always take this if I'm going somewhere in a restaurant or shopping in case it's cold inside. And this just gives you another look. I just love my jean jacket. It goes with a lot of things. And I just like how it looks with my dress. I love this fabric. Looks so cute with this fabric, doesn't it? So there's a little sneak peek on my pretty pin tuck dress. I'm just waiting for a couple people to finish testing uh, out my pattern to make sure everything's working before I upload it. And now I just need to finish editing the video um, tutorial on how to make this dress. So I'll have written instructions and I'll have a step-by-step -step video showing you exactly how to do the pin tucks and how to sew this dress together, including the burrito method, which makes it so much easier. Thanks to Jen. Thank you, Jen, for showing us how to do the burrito method. I love it. It makes making dresses so much easier. So I'm excited. I love this dress. I can't wait to wear it out and see the pockets. Always got my chapstick or my phone, but my phone's over there filming me, so I don't have it in here right now, but I love these, these little cute little pockets. Okay, here's my dress with a, with a cardigan. So you can dress it up with a cardigan. And here's a pretty pin tuck dress I made out of knit fabric that has a little bit of stretch, two-way stretch this way, and very little going down but it flows so pretty. I just love how the pin tucks look with the knit fabric. It's so pretty. I love this one. And I like wearing my pink cardigan with this one. I love cardigans. I think they really dress up an outfit. So you have a choice. You can make your pin tuck dress in cotton or in a knit fabric. I went to Joann's hoping I could find some fabric to match my tablecloth I bought. I bought this at um, Tuesday morning, but I wanted to have some cloth napkins to go with it. So I went to Joann's to see if I could find some fabric to match it. I was hoping to find a solid, one of these like aqua blue or blue greens here, but I couldn't find a solid, but I did find this. And boy, it doesn't, in person, it doesn't show up those little white white cloud looking things. In person, it's more of a solid, but I love the little shiny polka dots. It matches this flower right here in the tablecloth. So I'm gonna make some pretty cloth napkins out of this fabric. So I was happy to find that and it was on sale for $4.99 a yard. So yay. So that will be working on that in the future, making some cloth napkins. I love using cloth napkins, especially when I have company for dinner. I think it makes them feel special to have cloth napkins. And while I was there, I picked up some thread because they had the thread on sale. I think it was buy three, get three free. So I got three whites and you always need more black. And I got this to sew up my cloth napkins. And then while I was there waiting for my fabric to be cut, these were on display. And of course, they got me. I'm a sucker for anything pink or aqua. I just love these colors and I love having nice tape measures around. And these are so soft and so pretty. So those were like $1.27. I picked up those two. So, yay. And I just filmed a video um, where I show you how I sort and organize and store my scrap fabric and some ideas of how I used it to make some quilt blocks. So that will be coming hopefully this weekend. I'll get that one edited and out this weekend. And here's a sample of a quilt block I made using up my scrap fabric.
Comment below if you want me to make a tutorial on how I do this. If you like my video, make sure you hit the thumbs up. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much for joining me today. Have a so blessed day. Bye for now. <coughs>